Hello there everyone. Today I'm going to make uh, an extension for uh, for uh, your pack files. Um, and uh, these extensions are very cool because you can uh, you can make your your pack fly fishing very diverse uh, by by changing uh, out weights and stuff like that. So I've uh, attached in my vise uh, a flyman uh, a flyman uh, shank uh, that is uh, 3.5 centimeters. On this I've added a tungsten weight from uh, from uh, raw uh, this is to because I want this shank to uh, to drag my fly very fast down, and then uh, I'm gonna attach a small uh, a small snap uh, from VMC. You can use any type of snap as long as it is uh, as long as it's strong. This ensures that you can change uh, this uh, this section of the fly, this this uh, this head of the fly. Um, uh, uh, very easily, so you can you can actually make your fly uh, a lot bigger uh, uh, without much effort. Uh, also, you can make it a lot heavier if that's what you wish to do. So I take this tungsten head from uh, from this raw, raw weight and uh, uses this to uh, to close the uh, the metal gap here. And then I'm just applying some thread to ensure that everything is in place. Now, uh, as you can see, uh, the snap is fastened securely, but it's still hanging loose, which means that uh, the rest of the fly here will be uh, uh, allowed room to to be uh, to wriggle a lot and be uh, be and move very freely in the water. Okay. Then I'm gonna move down to uh, to the actual shank here. Then I'm going to take a material that's called a streamer brush, which is a, a strand of, uh, or two strands of, uh, of uh, thin metal wire, and in between those are made a dubbing loop from, uh, from uh, Steve Ferroblend. So this is uh, well, a wonderful material for pike flies. Indeed it is. Um, there is a fairly large amount of materials in, uh, in one of these packets. There are two strands of uh, approximately 45 centimeters of length, uh, 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 so so you definitely get a lot of value for your money with this uh, with this product. So I'm just gonna apply some thread all the way up here to uh, to ensure that uh, that my uh, my baitfish brush has something to uh, to grab onto while I'm turning it. Just gonna turn all the way up here to uh, to the eye of the fly and. Uh, then well it's basically just turning this streamer brush up and across the shank what i'm doing is i'm not tying this uh, 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 I'm, I'm tying this fairly loosely because i i don't want to, to have i don't want to have let's say 15 or or 10 uh, 10 turns of, uh, of this streamer brush because that would make this shank uh, very very thick and very very heavy and uh, and I don't want that I want maybe maybe four turns of this material uh, because I want this fly to be well <laughs> castable like so and uh, also you can see if you're only turning this material four times then definitely you'll have four a very large amount of flies before you you ran out of, of materials uh, if you use it like this so like that gonna cut off and uh, make sure that you're using uh, your old uh, worn scissor to to cut the metal wire and not your uh, your everyday nice sharp scissors because it won't stay nice and sharp if you cut the metal wire with uh, with those just gonna take my scissor and make sure that every part of this material is 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 laying or is, is covering the shank and nice and smoothly like a real hackle like so and uh, then I'm gonna take some uh, some orange saddle feathers and I'm just gonna take four or five of these. Uh, these will add an enormous amount of uh, of uh, contrast, uh, but also uh, uh, provide even even more vibrance and uh, and movement in the water. So 
I use these heckles, these saddle feathers for, for most of my pike flies, simply because I, I just I just can't get enough of the effect they have on the fly in the water. They pulsate and and move erratically around, so yeah, they are definitely great. Not that easy to come by, and uh, unfortunate they are also a bit expensive, but um, but they're well worth uh, the the price. In well, in my from my point of view at least, they really really make uh, they really really complete a fly like this, and and there is an enormous amount of feathers on uh, on one of these uh, these saddles. So if you haven't seen them in the shop, uh, make sure to swing by. They are from uh, Keok. Um, and well, I don't know how much you can see over there, but there is just a ludicrous amount of feathers uh, on a saddle. Well, that was four feathers. Then we need to tie one of the last materials here. I'm gonna use a marabou hackle on this one, so I'm taking a marabou feather in, uh, in orange. Attaching this here. Going off that stump. And then, well, basically, I'm just gonna turn this as a normal hackle. Making sure everything is in place and folded nice, nicely backwards. This again provides a lot of life to your flies. And this orange color uh, will, of course, work very well with the with uh, the orange uh, the orange flash pike streamer that I have uh, done in one of uh, the other videos. Uh, the the great thing about these shanks are that you can well, as I said, you can easily make a lot of uh, a lot of different uh, very easily make uh, your flies uh, be multi multiple. Multi have have a lot of, of different purposes. All you need to do is actually to change the front of your fly to make it fish deep or to make it become a popper or anything you actually want it to be. It can be with these uh, with these uh, with these um, with these shanks. I'm gonna do uh, show you how to make a, a popper shank in uh, in one of uh, the other videos. And that is fairly, fairly, fairly easy as well. So, with a minimum of effort, you have a very wide range of uh, of astonishing looking uh, flies, and uh, and uh, you can actually use uh, the the pattern uh, uh, in any color you like, of course. But the pattern uh, uh, Flash Pack Streamer Volume Two as your basic fly, and then just attach different kinds of heads or even if you don't want to attach the heads then the uh, the, f the flesh pack streamer uh, mark 2 is actually a very very great fly on its own its own right like so the last thing i'm going to do for this fly this is not a necessity but it uh, it will look great and it will uh, give your fly a, a great uh, a great fix fix point is i'm going to take one of these uh, pull soft heads, add a little uh, super glue to the groove and then uh, add the eye and uh, for this I'm using a, a, f a, f a living uh, living eyes also from Fly Fisherman in, uh, in the color uh, fire because that suits this fly rather good and there you have it uh, an extension that uh, adds a lot of uh, a lot of length, a lot of movement, and uh, and a lot of weight to your fly. Well, those were the words. Thank you for listening.